Prince George is set to play a big role at his grandfather King Charles' coronation on May 6. The nine-year-old son of Prince William and Kate Middleton will don a ceremonial sword at the event, representing his role as protector of the monarch as well as the second in line to the British throne behind the Duke of Cambridge. However, George's primary duty at the crowning is being one of the four pages of honour, while his siblings, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, will also have formal roles at the coronation. The other pages to join Charles at the Westminster Abbey ceremony include Lord Oliver Chamond Lee, whose parents are close friends of the King and Prince William, Master Ralph Ptolemaeus, son of the King's godson Edward Ptolemaeus, and Lord Oliver Chamond Lee, whose father is King Charles's lord. In waiting, the foursome will sport red cuts, white breeches and stockings and will be key components of the procession. A royal rep divulged to people recently that William and Middleton are very excited and delighted that their eldest son is taking part in the big event. It's something that his parents have thought long and hard about and are very much looking forward to. And I'm sure George is too, the spokesperson revealed. Charles's wife, Camilla, will be crowned alongside him next month, taking on the title of Queen Consort. The 75-year-old will also have her own set of pages to support her throughout the commemorative celebration, including Camilla's grandsons, twins Gus and Louis, 13, their teen cousin, Frederick, and her great-nephew, Arthur Elliot. The coronation invitation list has been capped at 2,000 people, although the event will be shorter than Queen Elizabeth's own crowning in 1953. Charles' ceremony is expected to be more inclusive than his late mother's and will be a modernised soiree. The coronation will reflect the monarch's role today and look towards the future while being rooted in long-standing traditions and pageantry. Buckingham Palace said in a statement last year, the Church of England's Archbishop of Canterbury, Justin Welby, will conduct the May 6th service, which has been declared a bank holiday in the United Kingdom. It would also appear that the former Prince of Wales is planning to wing his enthroning after, reportedly rehearsing the ceremony just once and without his ceremonial robe, according to the Telegraph. The informal rehearsal apparently took over the court at Buckingham Palace, with fake stage built to look like the 1,000-year-old church, the publication wrote. On April 11, the Mirror reported that the coronation could be total chaos as the rehearsal ran way over 90 minutes. It's all very frantic, complete chaos, to be frank, a royal source side. There is a plan which is supposed to be the blueprint of how the day should operate, but things are changing daily, which is causing massive headache. 